Hi, hello everyone, and welcome back to The Sims 4 100 Puppies Challenge. We are back in our little house right now, and it's supposed to be the twins' birthday today. So hopefully they should be aging up into twin- uh, what? Hopefully they should be aging up into, uh, toddlers soon. Hopefully by today, which means that we're gonna have to move out of our house. <laughs> and once these- hang on, I gotta- I gotta sort out these, these babies, because they've been crying all night. They haven't- they haven't been having a good time. <laughs> they need to- oh! Max is just woken up. Okay, she needs to go to the bathroom first, though. Uh, hopefully we should be moving out soon. Uh, I think as soon as the twins age up, which hopefully should be during this episode, uh, we will move out into a bigger house, which should allow the twins to age up and just have a lot more space to run around and a lot more stuff than just a bed, an easel and a guitar sort of thing in our house. Because right now our house is very, very small and very bare and it kind of sucks. So I definitely have been looking forward to moving out for so long. I cannot wait to finally live somewhere else. Max is going to the bathroom. Okay, so these guys, I think they need uh, feedings. So I'm going to get, okay, so River's feeding uh, Melody and then I'm going to get Max to feed Levi. Which hopefully she should do now. There you go. And then she's gonna feed him and then she needs to eat as well. We need to get everything. Oh, and then also we can open our vet too, which should give us a little bit more money to move out and stuff. Because currently we have 50,000. So I'm gonna get the business funds and transfer them um, from the vet into our household funds. So let's take maybe 30. Oh gosh. Maybe. Oh, you know what? Well, let's take 40,000. Then if we need to transfer it back. Um, oh, oh my gosh. Right. If we need to transfer it back, we will. Um, but right now, I think, I don't know how much the house will be. I can't remember exactly. Um, so when we move out, we might not have as much money as I thought we would. Um, Max, you need to, no, she's, she's eating. She's gonna go eat first. The babies are sleeping, which is great. I'm just sort of waiting for them to age up now. Uh, if, well, actually, while we're waiting, I do need to bath, uh, Nope, not you. Not you in the bath. I do need to bath um, the puppies because they are really dirty. And how long do they have until they age up? Star has... Oh, they both have one day left. So we definitely need to breed Buddy and Sasha again. I don't think she's pregnant yet. Sasha's not pregnant yet, is she? Oh, no! It says that she is expecting puppies. So we do have puppies on the way which should hopefully be here soon. I completely forgot that we had puppies. I didn't think that it- I completely forgot that it even worked. I thought it was- <laughs> I thought it hadn't. So she should be having babies as well soon. We'll have little puppies on- on the way. So hopefully she'll have the puppies and the twins will age up um, at some point today. <laughs> but if Sasha doesn't have her babies until tomorrow that's fine. We'll just have them in the new house. Max is cold but she needs to come out here. Oh we need to take all of these all of our plants with us. How are we going to do that? How do you... Can you take plants with you or am I just going to have to harvest them? And then... Oh no. Looks like that's a lot about to harvest. Okay. How... How... Do... Oh no. Now I'm worried. How are we going to do this? Because we don't have any of our dragon fruits. All of our dragon fruits are in the ground. <laughs> And our, and our bills have been have been um given to us, which means we've got to pay money. We were so close to moving out, but I think wait, if we if we moved house to a more expensive house, would we have had to pay bills for the bigger house? And I just realised because we're moving into a bigger house, we're gonna have bigger bills <laughs> to pay. And I completely didn't even think about that, so we're gonna have to make more money, which would hopefully be given. Like, uh, hopefully our vet clinic should cover that, so we don't have to worry too much about our uh, funds that we're being bringing into the household. Um, River, could you come and change him because he's crying and it's not very fun <laughs> to hear him crying all the time. Oh, and then we've got a um, we've got a bath, Joey as well. Is 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 uh, Sasha gonna have any puppies at all, or is it just gonna be? A waiting game. Who's gonna age up? Who's gonna have puppies first? Or no, will Sasha have puppies first or will the twins age up first? That's what we're trying to figure out first. Oh no, they're losing friendship. Oh, she's really cold. But she likes the cold. I thought it was. 
I thought she was supposed to not have the negative effects of that. Ice proof sims aren't negatively affected by cold temperatures. Well, River is, and she's supposed to like the cold. <laughs> so I don't know what that's all about. I thought... Maybe that's a glitch, I'm not sure. How are you doing? You're fine. Oh yes! Okay, she's going into labour, which means that we should have puppies soon. Okay, we've got a lecture about drinking puddle because you'll get dirty again, and we don't want that. River's in the bath. So, I'm just going to keep a really close eye on on Sasha. <laughs> Look at her, poor baby. Uh, hopefully she should have a baby soon. And then whenever these, whenever the babies grow up, because on the calendar it's saying that they should be aging up today. Um, so whether that will happen like in the middle of the night or something like that, we'll speed up a little bit quick, quicker. I mean, we could age them up ourselves, but I do like it happening naturally, so... Are you dirty again? I can't figure it out. Are you dirty or are you just like really dark? Okay, let me lecture you about drinking puddle as well. Do you know how to play- do you know how to not play in puddles or...? No. Sasha's still in labour. I wonder how many puppies we'll have this time. Will it be just two? Because we've had a lot of twos recently. I don't think we've had any litters with just one puppy in it. I don't think we have at all. No, none of, the, none of these guys had just one puppy in their litter. I think three was the biggest litter we've had. I don't think we've had a four litter yet. Oh, Eva was really cute too. Oh, it was really cute seeing all the different puppies we had. All the different puppies we had that were all unique and cute. And hopefully this litter will include a cute puppy. Oh my gosh, it's Buddy's birthday today as well. So much is happening. Buddy's going to turn into an elder, which is crazy. You're so young, Buddy. You're not supposed to be an elder yet. Oh, that's so sad. And then Sasha's got four days until she ages up. Fair enough. The puppies have one day until they age up, so that should be tomorrow. Uh, babies are crying again, so let's change, change you. They're crying, so... Right, and I'm gonna watch. Is she gonna have any puppies anytime soon? Not looking like it. Oh, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, we've got some puppies about to arrive. What will they be? How many will we have? Okay, they're almost here. <laughs> oh, okay, a baby girl. Awesome. So, we'll, uh, as always, we'll name them Young, because that is um, Max's last name. And then... Oh my gosh, look at Paul. <laughs> look at Buddy in the background. What is going on with him? Let's just have a look for some names we could have for her. Oh, Nova's a cute name. I like Nova. And him. Okay, so we've got a baby boy. Young. And we will name him... Muffin. Oh, Axel. Axel's a cute name too. So, what do they look like? Oh my gosh. Is that Axel? Axel looks really unique. That's the... That is the most unique puppy we've had so far, I think. My goodness. Wow, I think Axel might be the one we're keeping. That is a very unique puppy. I like him. That's very cute. So, that looks like... It looks like Axel will be the next uh, dog we use in our... Uh, puppies breeding what we even do it like with our 100 puppies challenge basically he will be the next heir to the um, breeding um, and then oh he's a glutton these pets will eat significantly these pets will eat significantly more often and much more messily I wonder if we could um, get rid of that trait eventually and then adventurous oh Nova's adventurous active and a hunter oh she's actually a lot darker than um her mother. Where is she? She's all here. She's like a black husky. So she's actually a lot more different than I thought she was. Because Sasha's like brownish. Whereas... Oh, that is really cute. She looks like um an, an Alaskan Malamute. <laughs> oh, and then River, you're just standing there watching um, poor Buddy like, please give me food. I am desperate. I'm so hungry for food right now. <laughs> and she just stood there watching him. 
Oh no, Kipper, don't. We've just bathed you. We've just bathed you. Oh, and Axel's a playful dog. Of course, I didn't even remember that. I completely forgot about that already. And look at him in the snow. He's like, oh, I thought he was stood up. I thought he was like completely uh, buried in the snow, but no, he's just lying down. His eyes look really blue whenever I look them on the screen. But then on his profile, they are brown. Yeah, they are brown. They look blue sometimes when I look at them. But he's a very cute dog, like a, a very ginger dog. <laughs> and he's got some little white spots on his back. That'd be really interesting to see what he looks like as an adult. Um, I really want to get one more litter out of Sasha and Buddy, but I I don't think I can. I think that might be the last litter. If not, we might breed them one more time. If, if Buddy can breed as an elder, I think we'll breed them once more. I think. At least we'll try. And then I think Axel will be our next um, heir for the puppies. Who are you? Thorn Bailey. Oh, right. Thorn Bailey. And the, pu the, the babies still haven't aged up yet, so we're still waiting for that. Axel's under the table, barking at Max. <laughs> and then Max. Oh, gosh. I'm moving this outside by accident. Get back in there. Get back in there. Um, the babies, they're awake, or at least Melody's awake, but Levi's just sleeping. <laughs> and there's nothing, nothing happening. I'm just, I can't wait for them to age up. Come on, you've got to do it. You've got to age up. If they don't age up by the end of the, uh, by the end of the day, then I'm going to age them up. <gasps> Look at this little family of puppies. A little family of doggies. Oh, and all the poor prints in the, in the snow. <laughs> and Sasha's trying to turn around, but I've, I've paused her in a very weird, um position right now oh that is so cute that is adorable okay so star looks just like her mom and then none of them look like um none of them look like buddy at the moment because uh joey axel and then nova they're all quite unique to be fair i think this is the most unique sort of lot of puppies we've had so far i think most of them have been copies of buddy or sasha but I think it'd be really interesting to have Axel. And then we'll have to figure out what breed of dog we want our next uh, puppy's parent to be. So if you have any ideas for like the next uh, breed of dog we should breed with Axel, then let me know. Because um, that'd be really interesting to figure out what kind of dog... Because we won't have a husky anymore and we won't have an Australian sheepdog like Kipper and Sasha. I think we'll do a different one so we have even more unique puppies. Oh, we should get a Dalmatian in sometime. Maybe not this time. I think <laughs> Axel's quite spotty, to be fair. Um, but maybe another time we could get a an, um, a Dalmatian in for another another litter. The babies are crying. Are they hungry or are they just wanting attention? I can never tell with babies. She's feeding her, which is great. And Levi's looking okay now. Can you? Let's just have them oh no she was about to go to sleep and i woke her up by accident i'm so sorry oh what is she made is that a person oh it is a person wow you're a very um talented sculpt sculptor river <laughs> oh no and then we've got to teach the puppies to not lick electrobat drinking puddle what's wrong with sasha she looked sad or is she just looking around Oh, she's she's tired. Go and ha go and sleep. Oh, Buddy's gone in on in the <laughs> thing. Oh, poor Sasha. I just realized we don't even have a sofa. Can you sleep on the bed? You can relax on the bed. Can you sleep on the bed though? I can never remember. Go on, have a little have a little go. Nope, she's gonna sleep near the table instead. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. The babies still haven't aged up. Just waiting around for them to age up, but nothing's happening just yet. Max, you've got a phone call. Simon Scott is wondering if you want to go out. No, we're waiting for the babies to grow up. They could grow up at any moment right now. We can't we can't miss this moment <laughs> of them growing up. I don't think they're gonna grow up this episode, honestly. They better. I'm gonna age them up though. If they don't age up, then I, w I will age them up myself. Oh, good job. Max is going to do it himself. Herself, I mean. Um, and then Buddy looks like he needs a bath, so I'm gonna go and give him a bath. Go and give Buddy a bath. He he really needs it, honestly. Max is using the clay again. <laughs> They're obsessed with that clay. They they won't leave that alone. Uh, I told you to go and bath. Hey, I told you to go bath 
buddy, you haven't done it. How dare you? Go and, um... Wait, let me... I can't... How do I bath you? <laughs> give bath. Okay, give bath to buddy. He really needs it. Um, and then... I was going to do something, but I forgot. I'm very forgetful. I just completely forgot what I was doing. Pet training. Oh! I'm sure it was something to do with their, their training. Maybe not. Obviously he doesn't have any skills. I don't know. I don't remember what I was going to look for. Oh my gosh. Any luck with the babies? No. Not looking like it. Oh look at Axel. He's so tiny on the bed. He's so tiny. Okay I'm going to speed speed through. And if they're not... Um... Oh! Well that was a bit speedy okay melody aged up um what could her trait be she could be oh i'm trying to think of a thing that's like close to melody nothing about singing anything in here oh melody could be can be a singer when she's older that'd be really cute if that if that happened uh melody could be independent a charmer her first thing was wild so i'm gonna go with wild and then levi aged up and his thing can be angelic there we go first thing it you good? <laughs> you good? Melody? Age up, okay. Gosh, the way she just stood up looked really creepy. I don't know, I didn't like that. Melody aged up. Toddlers, days spent playing with toys, exploring the world, and learning to communicate with words instead of tears await. This is the perfect time to start skill building for the future. Great, okay, so let's change them then. Alright, so I went in and I changed the toddler's looks just a little bit because, um, obviously, just to make them look a little bit nicer than they were before. What is she doing? She's playing- Oh my gosh, do not do that! <laughs> okay, come here. I want to have a look at you. Right, we got Melody, who looks just like her mother. Or, well, I mean, she's got two mothers, so. <laughs> um, she looks just like Max in the sense that she has black hair, just like her, and she also has really dark brown eyes, just like her as well. And so I gave her some nice long hair and a little dress with a little cat on it because obviously she's an animal lover just like her parents. And then we have little Levi who is, oh gosh, super cute and he looks just like River in the sense that he's got blonde hair and blue eyes which is just like River's eyes as well. And then he's got a little bear jumper on and a lovely little trousers which looks very cute on him. So the twins are definitely not identical in any sorts of ways. They look completely different, but I think that's really cute. I love it when toddlers look complete opposites of each other. So that means that next time we are here, I'm going to be moving us out. So for the time being, I'm going to just let them have a little sleep and um, I will end this one here so that next time we are absolutely completely ready to move. Um, so I'm going to end this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it and I will see you guys next time. Bye.